Yes, indeed. JK and Spawn. Alright, we're going to continue on, play chapter 2 now. I'm going to keep my voice a little bit down because my cousin's going to sleep, but... Nick will never forget me. I'll show you right now what I mean. I don't know what you mean. Okay, okay. Let's play. Game 2. Play. Episode 2, start for help. This does not look good. And for all you new viewers, I stream 12 hours a day, 9 o'clock till 9 o'clock, Monday to Friday, for New Zealand time. The walking dead. I know who you are. I got another good Watch one out. for you. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug. You got it, boss. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. <laughs> Oh my god. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you, but if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Uh, Wolfgang, just let me know what it's called. Send me a Twitch message, actually. Send me a private message of what it's called. And the link to the to the main page, please. That would be nice. Although I'm not entirely sure if I need it, but we'll see. I'll take a look into it. Thank you for the offer. And Inspiron, yes, you've just posted the times so that everybody knows. It's a little bit ambiguous to post those times. Um, that is the time tomorrow when we are playing Borderlands 2 with me, OP Nerd, Diddy Gaming, and one of OP Nerd's real life friends. Oh God! Exit. <laughs> What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. Yeah, Nick Flutie was referring to those asterisks. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was gonna take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Oh god, zombie rabbits. I get yeah, a rabbit from. You're right. I wish I knew for sure how much grail. food we have left. Monty Python's the Holy Grail. We would be so screwed. MZT is GMT plus 12, not minus 12. That much, huh? Does Kenny know? I don't know. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor end. And yet, you know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. London time is GMT plus one right now since you're in daylight savings. Kenny won't abandon us. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Larry's Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. He's an old racist asshole. He's just an old racist asshole. That's his deal. Thanks, Wolfgang. Well, he needs to get over that and start finding a way to pull his weight. Heart problems or not, we should all be out here trying to find food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. Yeah, Dig, we do have daylight saving time, but opposite to your time. Since we're on the opposite uh, 
hemisphere of the world, your summer is our winter and vice versa. So right now it's the middle of winter for me. We're not in daylight saving time. Don't rest noise. Don't. God shadow bring walkers. When birds not worthy. <sighs> yeah, I know. I'm just really freaking hungry. Just nibble on your little. Ah! Shit, was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. Oh shit. He stood in a bear trap or something, didn't he? Whatever. He bear traps in these woods, I think. Oh my god. It was a mere top! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, Come down, you guys, guys. okay? Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap We're out not here? Gonna hurt you. It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Lee, this is fucked up. We've gotta help. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Dude, just see if you can out. get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Uh, well, uh, we'll try. Gotta get him out of there. Oh God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. Hurry, please, hurry. Yeah, Travis knows pickup tactics because his dad was in the military. Please, <laughs> trap been on. My dad's an honest. There's no I'm release latch. Oh dear, oh, walkers. No. Shit, walkers. It's now or never, Lee. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Don't worry, I'll, uh, I'll open Why it. Why is this happening to us? It's no problem, man. Ah, Put it over! Lee, do stop something! Stop happening. Please! Can I chop the chain? Get me out of this! Chop the chain, don't chop oh, his leg off. Those things are gonna be here soon. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Please hurry! Yeah, man. I chop the chain. Hurry! Ah. Oh, man, oh, man. Shit, I can't do it, man. Let's I can't go, do it. I've got to chop your leg off, bro. I'm sorry. I've got to... Is he going to make it? I have it? to chop your fucking leg off. I'm sorry, my friend. Oh, God. It has to be now. No, no, no. Try the trap again. Anything, please. I'm sorry, my friend. I have to chop your fucking leg off. Oh, oh. Man, please just cut off his fucking leg. I can't, I can't we don't have time for that. that. I'm sorry, but we have to go. Now. Ah, we can skip. Out. Fine, fine, just drag him. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on, Travis. we gotta move! Uh, run, run, Travis! The dead speak ups, come on! The gamed TA, welcome to the stream, sir. Twenty six viewers, holy crap. Most viewers full time. Austinac, welcome to the stream. We should have just left. We should have just brought the two guys who weren't trapped in the bear trap. Holy shit. Don't 
Thank you, Wolfgang. Don't spoil stuff, everybody. Let me know if I need to boost my mic, because I do have to talk quite quietly right now. No matter what you do, at least one of them dies. Well, it's not much of a consolation, is it? Good gravy ninja chicken. Get I the gates open! Burger. We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! My God. Oh dear. What happened? Oh, what the hell? What's going on? I don't have time to explain. See? Are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee! I, I don't know. Lee! Yes, What hello. the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? I needed help. Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. He would have died if we left him. So what? We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group. Right here, right now. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. Mm -hmm. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries. Shit, man. Are you? Um, More hints no? we can put together Fine. the middle of the world. Fight it out there. <laughs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You, know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running Kenny's out, right. suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kinney's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? You weren't there. Lee made a choice. End of story. Yeah, the game. Once Katja um, patches that guy up, you can right kick now, him out sure. I'm not Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the Walkers. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd realize that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? You know what? If you think I'm doing such a shitty job, then you do it. Mm, I don't really want to distribute the food. That's all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. Let's put it in a blender. No, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to not have enough food for everyone. Just blend all the food and everybody can get a very small drink. <laughs> it's fine. It'll be fine. We only have four food items for ten hungry people. Well, the more people we have, the more people we can eat. The way I see it. <laughs> okay. Who's looking hungry? Shit. Kenny don't need no food. He, he good. He good to go. We got up to 27 viewers there for a second, by the way, I think. Holy crap. Keep all the food for myself. Yes, my precious. My precious food. Don't give the food to these filthy hobbitses. Oh, shit. Who do we give food to? All looks good. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. <laughs> oh, Larry. Larry's funny sometimes. Oh, he is very hungry. And he brought us a lot of food. We have four pieces of food. We need to keep the kids... Let's talk to people. We know he's hungry. We know the old man's not that hungry. 
How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Of course I can. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Okay, okay. Uh, how you holding up, Ben? Hey, is my friend gonna make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There's no other way. Uh, so how you holding up, man? How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, uh... I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of... I don't know. Something. I know what you mean. You did all you could, my friend. You'll be you'll be ready next time. You'll be prepared next time. Next time? Yeah. Relax. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. I'm just gonna talk to everybody first and then decide who I want to give food to. Duck, how you doing? How you doing, Duck? I'm okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is? I don't know. A dog? No. Nope. Oh, I know. It's a goat, right? <laughs> a goat. No. Okay, McFlutie, I'm gonna take your advice on this one. Want some food, kid? Hey, Doc. How about a little food? <laughs> Sorry. 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 So I don't I don't see what the uh, what the thing was there, my friend McFluty, but uh let's talk to Carly. She looks extremely hungry and like she's got some kind of period cramps. Um what do I do? Lily has me handing out the food. Ugh. That can't be an easy job. It's not. I won't be able to feed everyone. What should I do? Well, if you wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food. Even though that guy can be a real dick sometimes. Fuck Larry. On the other hand, giving that food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you. If he decides to take off in that RV one day. What about you? You need food too. We all need food. I can't tell you what to do. But whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to do the right thing. Thanks, Carly. She looks totally uncomfortable. Like she's keeled over in pain at how hungry she is. So we're gonna give we're gonna give her give her Want some something food. to eat. Um, you can have the half. You can have a piece of jerky. That's what you need, I think. Here. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? I'm fine. I'm okay. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. Yo, no, take the food. I know I it. said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but you don't owe me anything, Carly. Can I hold her down and give her food? Cause she really needs it. Look at her; she's so hungry and thin. All right, Kenny. Yeah, boy. What's up, man? Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. I'm not sure that's the best idea. You gave Glenn your blessing when he left. Just asking you respect my choice as well. Good yeah, dick. but he was leaving to find his friends. Your family's right here. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. I'm thinking about uh, sounding I like your idea, Kenny. The coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Okay, man. Good idea. Let's go get some food to uh, little, uh, little Lucky. We teased him already, so let's actually give him food this time. Yeah, boy. Hey, Ducky. Hey, Doc. How about a little food? You can have the piece of jerky. Here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man, I'm so hungry. I know he liked jerky. Hey, Clementine. I know you've got to be hungry. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. You can have... Hmm. Hmm. What do we give her? She can have half an apple, I think. She's still little. She doesn't need lots. I she love apples. Thank you. Are there more? 
No, honey. That was the last one. Oh, um... Enjoy it. You deserve it. Half an apple. She loves apples. I'm a boss. I'm the best at distributing food. Okay, we give some to the sniper. Hey, man. Here, eat something. You're a pretty sophisticated guy. You can add the crackers and cheese, you know, dip your crackers. You know, wee oui, wee. Oui. Mm -hmm. C'est magnifique. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. I'd prefer to have my axe. Mark, have the axe. Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. Fuck you, Larry. You didn't think to give me the axe? Come on, Larry. Give it a rest, man. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. Oh, and that's what you think this is? <laughs> is that what you told him? I didn't tell him nothing, man. That's, uh... Yep. Yeah, that's right. And what are you gonna do about it? Look, I don't care what it is, but you two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. You can protect your daughter. Right now, your that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. Yeah, don't worry, I'm gonna give something else to, something to Ben. Hey, Sophia, welcome to the stream, by the way. I don't know if, have, have I already greeted you? I don't know. I'm just, there's so many new viewers. I just can't keep, can't keep track, man. Keep the last, I'm gonna save the last piece of food for somebody else. Oh, uh, some of these that. people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. I got food stored on my goatee there. My chin strap. I don't need to eat that food. Yeah, boy. Hey, Kenny. Hey, Benny. Whatever your name is. Can we give it to her? She totally needs it. Well, we can't. We already tried. Alright, hey Ben. Want something to eat? Hey Ben, you want some food? Here's your crackers and cheese, boy. Here's if your the camp got raided, it probably means you haven't eaten in a while. I am really hungry. Thanks. Sophia! Digital QR says. Sophia! Sophia! <laughs> Not such an easy job, is it? That's Never pretty, said it was. Pretty easy job. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee. Kenny, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice. But you took care of the kids. That's what a real man That's does. Damn right. You gotta keep care of the kids. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still... I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. Some people. You're out! Themselves. What happened to my food? There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. Good, I'm leaving. You're you one to talk, old man. Yeah? Well, I don't see you working on that wall. Which people hate Ben? I haven't played this game through, so don't, don't spoil it. Ken! Lee! Come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. Oh shit. God damn it. Oh shit, he's gonna fucking I'm getting you. sick of this God. shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing. Let him go, Kaja. What? He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That Can man you brought, I tried, that. but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. Yeah, he is. You see, frickin' us! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh move, move. <laughs> Shit, it's stuck. <laughs> You okay? Yeah. Thanks. 
Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. Shit. We're all infected? Everyone? I... I guess so. I don't know. I... All I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God... Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we... We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Uh, are you... We, we don't want any trouble, my friend. We don't want any trouble. Of course, uh, n neither do we. Uh, I'm Andy St. John. This here's my brother, Dan. We're just out looking for gasoline. Looks like you folks got the motel locked down, which, which is fine, but uh, if you could spare any gas, well, we'd be much obliged. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If, if y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out, see if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Okay, no, no more racism. So, uh, what do y'all think? Seriously, more racism like that. I mean, I know it's all in good fun, but if there are, like, if there are black people watching this and they don't take kindly to black people racism, then it's not going to go well. So, one more time, even if it's all in good fun, one more time and you're getting timed out, two more times and you're getting banned. So, really, just keep, keep the racism away. Okay, uh... Let's go to the dairy and talk to these guys. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Yeah, good idea. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. Follow. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? How about no sure reason to We lost anybody. most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Kenny keeps us motivated. Kenny keeps us motivated. He believes in hope and knows how important it is for us not to give that up. I can't fault him for that. Or maybe you just don't want to be in charge. Well. Not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I lied to her, but... What exactly did happen with the senator? It was an accident. It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years, I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? I uh, grew up in Macon. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Uh, it's a democracy. 
We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Thank you, Genyans Gaming, and welcome to the stream. Uh, yeah, we have nine. Nine, including the kids. You forgot Ben. Me? Oh. Huh. That makes it ten. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for, well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. Oh no one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who oh, are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. They are. And you guys were keeping it there's all There's only two of them. Oh, no. There's yeah, and you know what? More we ate it all. What are you going to fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! <laughs> Jesus! Asshole! See you, McFlurry. Thanks for stopping by. Going to shit. I hope you sleep. Come on. Let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Here it is, St. John Family Dairy. <laughs> Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Have you ever had any accidents? Well, this is brilliant. This is a really brilliant setup. Suits us just fine. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farmhands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? We work together. We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, mm -hmm. we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? Or? We brought gasoline. Thanks for having us. We brought some gasoline on good faith. We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Oh Amazing. God. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What she... We have a vet. But we could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Nefisma, were you asking why me don't I, I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food, 
And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Let's make sure the place is... Let's... Uh, we should help out lots. They're offering us food. We should do whatever we can to make these people like us. The way Brenda was talking, I get the feeling like she'd be happy to have us stay. All the more reason for us not to fuck this up. If Andy needs some help securing the perimeter, then that's what we do. To answer your question, Nath, smile. At the moment, I'm running two tracks in my mind. One is obviously playing this game. And it's like, holy shit. You can see how I'm feeling about this game. And the second one is, um... Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. Uh, can, I, can I fix it? Mind if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Yeah, we can fix swings all day. Yeah, and the second track in my mind right now is the that I'm streaming and interacting with the chat and that. And that is over the moon. And so I'm at 21 full, uh, viewers right now. And I reached 27 uh, half an hour ago, whatever, which is the highest ever, so... Yep, I'm pretty chuffed, my friend. Pretty chuffed. This is too big right now. But if I can find something to cut it down to size, this might make a good seat for the swing. The moon! Yes, yeah, let's use the moon mm. to cut it down. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. By the way, guys, let me know if I need to increase the volume of my microphone. Because I am talking quite quietly because my cousin's sleeping nearby. So, just let me know if it's too quiet. Use my incredibly weak arm to chop the wood. That's right, that's right. Let's go fix that. So we need some rope. Where's some rope? How can I uh, help with this thing? Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Uh, we can, yeah, we can help protect the dairy. Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. Let's go fix the perimeter. Wait. I'm gonna get to know the place for a minute. Okay, well, we gotta secure the perimeter, so don't take too long. Alright, so I am a little bit quiet. Here we go. I'll just press escape here. Tab out. Boost my microphone a little bit. Audio. What am I doing here? Mic auxiliary boost. Testing, 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 testing. Is that better? Did that increase it? I don't know if that did or not. Test, test, test. It doesn't seem like it increased it much at all. Test, 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 test. That's good. Oh, I think, it, okay, I just increased it again, so I'll put it back down to where it was when you guys said it was good. Okay, there we go. We should be good to go. Alright, let's get back in the game. Thanks, guys, for that uh, feedback there. Where's this rope? How can we fix... Do we need... Do we have the rope for this yet or not? Hey, man. So what's your read on Andy so far? Think they'd be open to letting us stay? Uh, securing the perimeter will be a great getting idea. Getting the perimeter secured is gonna help us a lot. We'll be getting in good and making this place safer for us. I'm gonna get back to it. How cold is it now? It's actually not that cold where I am right now. Interestingly. Oh, what's... Use board on swing. Yes, let's do that. It's actually not that cold right now, which is good. It's been a relatively warm couple of days for New Zealand winter. But still cold. Just the board is good, but I need some rope. Where the Johnny do I get some rope? Oh, let's go. Maybe we should just secure the perimeter first. And then we'll find some rope at some point. Can I go through here, maybe? Thank you. 
30 degrees we are. Good gravy. Let's open the shoe bucket. Maybe there's some rope. I don't, have people died because of the cold in New Zealand, you mean? <laughs> I, I imagine so. for the swing. I mean, I imagine at some point somebody in New Zealand died from it being too cold and they didn't have have any blankets or warm clothing or a roof over their head and stuff, but n nobody's going to die inside. This isn't a third world country. <laughs> so we're not, we're not just going to... Oh god, it's the winter. My All children right. are going to die this, this winter. This shouldn't be too tough. Doesn't happen. Well, I'll be damned. I fixed the swing, man. Look, check it out. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully our kids will like it, too. Did you say something, darling? Oh, my goodness. Did you do that? Just trying to help out a bit around here. You know, I used okay, to push Annie and his brother out later. here on that swing Sleep every ball. night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. Sleep well, ninja chickens. May you may you dream of many ninjas and many chickens, and many chickens with the abilities of ninjas. Okay, let's talk to. Can we? Shall we go secure the perimeter now, Andy? Hi. Let's uh, let's go fix the perimeter. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Yeah, Liam, you want it to rain when you're inside your own tent? You probably want it to rain so that it keeps away all the gremlins and monsters and things. I would never go camping. In a like in a one man tent on my own, I would freak the shit out. Do you think we're doing There's enough no to get the St. John's to like us? Well, we don't want to seem over anxious. Showing them we can handle this fence is gonna go a long way. I can't wait until everyone's out here. For everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? As if tensions weren't high enough. Sorry, man. It just it popped out. I mean, you did admit it right to his face. Yeah, he's a piece of shit. But I try to be civil. I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. If you bring a machete or some kind of knife, you'll be fine. You're crazy, man. Ugh. Yeah, I know it's a mean wolf gang. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Who shot it in the head with an arrow? Let's take the arrow. Disgusting. Who shot it, though? Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Oh, I know why you wanted your own tent, Liam. Oh, I know why you wanted your own tent. All right, let's push them off. Uh, come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. Can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Yeah, a fortress needs people to defend it. A fortress needs people to defend it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Hmm. We, uh, what do you mean? What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's Good all. Man. Thanks. Good man. There's another one. I see it. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Uh, what if its brain is still in that? Oh, gross. Gross, gross. Oh, my you never God. get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Christ, I can't stop thinking about dinner. You can... Thanks for the rations earlier. How can you it's think about dinner? It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. Yeah, man. Yeah. I'm hungry too, my friend. I'm hungry too, Mark. 
Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. They've got a whole fat lady to eat. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> yeah, you'd think they'd reinforce these posts, but they're silly. Silly people. Little help here, Lee? Yeah, man, I'll help you. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why oh, the shit. hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> what the? Get to the gate. Oh shit. Oh shit. Get down! You asshole! Jesus! Oh shit. You got now you're fucked! Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on, that gate is our only way out! Where's our food, you asshole? Let's push it. Did you really think you could fuck with us? It's stuck. Shit in the ball sacks. We had a deal. Get closer. Holy shit. I already got one of you, you assholes deserve to die. Behind the tractor. Holy shit. Holy shit. I don't want to look up too much. Oh, activate the no right fuel. Of course. Oh shit, this thing. Okay, Come on, let's go, let's we go. We can reach the gate. We can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! What about our shit, that is. Oh my god. Give us the food! You fuck with us! Now we'll take what we want! Oh, yeah. What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. We're gonna have to move him. Did you really think you could fuck with us? Can I, can I move him then? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Where do you think you're going? Oh, my God. Fuck you, Over there. Oh, my God. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? Just two. Oh dear. Don't pull its arm off, man. Oh my god! Oh shit. Oh shit. You okay? Yeah. Barely. Come on. The oh, gate's shit. right there! Oh shit. Let's get to the gate. Let's get to the fucking gate, man. Oh my god. Oh, god. Let's get out of here. You lucky sons of bitches! Go ahead and run! We ain't going nowhere! Oh shit. What's wrong? The electric fence came on. The electric fence came on. Some people started attacking from the woods, and we got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit, are, are you okay? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out, but god damn it hurts. Oh shit. Hey y'all. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, god. honey, come on, Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, oh, you must yeah. be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it.
Carly said this place was locked down tight. It isn't as safe as we thought. Maybe it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. That's mighty kind of her. Hey, kids! Look what Lee got working for you. A swing! I love swings! Just like at my treehouse! Come on, Doc! Thanks, Lee. You're the best! Yeah! Oh man. Can we go through here? Kill all sons of bitches. You're right. That's swing. It's the hay pile. Look at this suspicious hay pile. Feel free hay pile. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. But where the cow? Nobody cares about Lily and Larry. Lots of hay. Hmm. Enough of these might work as adequate cover from arrows, if that becomes a problem. Mm, clever. Nothing over here, nothing over there. Check out the day. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Indeed, indeed. Descent, descent level Pokemon. All right, all right. Let's go inside. Let's go, fellas. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Let's go. Yeah, we gotta work it's together on this. Mario. Those bandits are a danger to everybody. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. See anything? Not yet. I know it's around here. It's gotta be close. Here. Oh shit, you found it?
Oh man, went down all the way down to 15 views. What a disappointment. <laughs> Which is like a hilariously large number for me normally. This camp's a bit disorganized. You see anybody? Stay on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. Can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. You're just waiting for Lee to trip over. Wow. Bottles. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Indeed, Lee, indeed. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Stuff. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days, they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <sighs> I'll pass. Ooh, what is this? Boxes from the dairy here. Probably a food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Gonna check it. I wanna check it. What the hell, man? What the hell? Shopping cop? Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Anything in the pot, I wonder? Any pot in the pot? Just water. Any of them mar marijuanas in the pot? Marijuanas? So look at the crate. Nothing. And let's have a look in the box. Empty. There's nothing here. No. Nope. camera what do you find a video camera let me see that battery's dead though oh good. good what else they got over here let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. why is that good you sneaky son of a bitch I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well you a hunter no but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule Lily huh Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Nah, you're crazy, man. You're crazy. Alright, well. Nothing in the tent, I guess. We'll check quickly. We'll check. Yeah, why the fuck was it good? There's no batteries in that camera. Pretty sure it's not good. Wait a second. The woman in there looked familiar. Oh god, what is that? The okay. hell? Don't you fucking move! Shit! Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. 
steal everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? Well, that's a hell of a question, mister. They told me I'd be safe with them. Men who lived here. But it weren't safe. Not for me. And not for my girl. They didn't treat her nice. Not at all. They took her away into the woods. Wouldn't tell me where. And I faked them every way I could think. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed them. And I'm staying here till she comes back to me. One way or another. She'll come back. Now maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her! So what if I did? You stole her from me! What? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'ma head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Put down the crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for us. Oh. God damn it! Well, thanks. I guess. Well, you're welcome. I guess. <sighs> It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. What Going a waste? Back? If they ain't here, I don't know oh, where they are. Boy. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Take the Xbox One, the X-Bone, the Crossbone. Come on. Follow me. Excuse me. That was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back! What happened? Handled it, Mama. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody, then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Yeah, they kind of agree on how to run things. They have different ideas about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry and people get a little stir-crazy when their tummy's empty. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. How'd she save your life? What happened? Hey, Clementine. I found your hat. Ha ha, I'm the 
best. A moon saver. <laughs> you guys and your moon. You're all crazy. I can't believe I haven't dropped below 15 viewers in the last couple of hours since I started streaming again after dinner. This is quite incredible. <laughs> oh, RJ, you and your It's cats. okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> she so licked it. Oh my god. Here, Clementine. How do you like that cow, Clem? She's pretty. How are they getting milk? What you do is you grasp the 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 uh, the teat firmly in your grip, and you you make this kind of motion. You know, or to get another view, you go like that. Will it? <laughs> and then milk comes out. Here's your head, Clem. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it. I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? I think I'd like to. I'd like to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on, ain't it? By the way, guys, in all seriousness, I think to milk a cow, you grab the teat at the top, and then you squeeze it from the top, and, like, you squeeze your top fingers first, and then pull down like that, and squeeze like that, you know, like that, while you move your hand down. So you grab it at the top, and then you go like that, and squeeze down. I think that's how you do it. I've never actually milked a cow, but I think that's how you do it. Can we get in here? You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her. I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Kachina, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. We can unscrew this shit. Totally unscrew this shit. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? <laughs> no. Why would you say that? <laughs> well, you're... You black. know... You're black. Urban? Oh. You are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Hmm. What? See those screws? Uh, Instead of breaking the padlock, oh we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. This guy. All right, sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? You know how to pick a lock, right? You're black. Uh, just checking out the barn. Just right? checking out the barn here. 
Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. We gotta open this door. We gotta open it. Do we have a screwdriver? Distract Andy to get him out of the barn. There be a screwdriver in here? Nope. Oh, uh. In other news, Empty. I know how to pick locks, IRL. Both combination locks and pin locks, tumbler locks. I learned, I googled it when I was like 14. There's a salt lick. What else do we have here? I want to play in the hay. I need to go out. Just stay close to your mom for now. I don't know if you mean IRL, okay. I need to get a life, or. Or if you're talking about um, in the game, I need to leave the bar. Make sure my stepdad had a, uh, a motorcycle lock. You know, like a chain that you put on, a combination lock chain that you put on the ta the, the wheels to uh, lock it up. But he forgot the combination, so I worked it out for him. Hey, man. Hey, hey there, Andy. Andy. Yeah. But, um, Danny mentioned he needed something. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. All right, now let's open that motherfucking door. Now where's the goddamn screwdriver? Do we have one? Oh, in here. Nope, nothing in here. But when you want to break into something, yeah, give me a call. <laughs> no, I've never used my lock picking for nefarious deeds. It's a feeding trough. <laughs> He's like, what the fuck are you doing, player? Why the fuck are you looking in a feeding trough? There's a multi-tool outside. Thanks, I'll take a look in a sec. Like a bunch of old dirty clothes. That's interesting. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Alright, let's go outside, get that moldy tool. We could just use our fingernail anyway. <laughs> Wiggle it open, no problem, man, no problems. False alarm, I'm back. Damn it. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. He isn't strong enough to <laughs> use his fingernail. Yeah, yeah. He's too weak. Way too weak. Where's this multi-tool that you were telling me about? Maybe it's over by this thing. The generator. Maybe it's up this way. G'day there, matey potato lily. By the saw. Okay, What's going thanks. on, Lee? Did something happen? Um, there's something odd with the barn. Kenny thinks they're hiding something. Kenny thinks they're hiding something. I'm not sure what exactly, but we're starting to get a feeling about this place. I don't know. Maybe we should go have a look in that barn. Whatever you do, just be careful. Um, yeah, okay. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Cheers. It's nice that you show a bit of concern for me. We need to jack the fence, you say? Thanks for the tip. Oh, what's that? Look at cornfield. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. I don't think we're gonna be staying here. 
This is already looking bad. Wasn't it the generator? Mess up the generator. I get ya, I get ya. We just gotta jack up the generator, take the multi tool. I get ya, I get ya. You guys are clever. Multi tool. Mm, multi tool. That should be handy. Now pick it up instead of just looking at it. Just Gotta give it a good work. for a second. Okay, now jack the generator on. Can we open it? Hmm. Guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. Let's open this shit. There you go. Now let's remove this thing. <clears throat> that thing is on too tight for my bare hands. Now let's chop it. There, that should do it. <laughs> Frack. It's the subtitle. I can't believe it. Son of a frack. He was totally saying frack. Frack. <coughs> Goodness gracious. I just inhaled a little bit of my own spit. <coughs> just about killed myself. Goodness gracious. You're really bad at writing it in English, Sophia. So are you, um, some, you know, is English not your native language then? <coughs> if only I had the remote! Exactly, I could just go. Spit would unclear. Well, yeah, Mom, clear. Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't, don't make the children wait. Just because wait. you're black doesn't I'll make mean an excuse you can for you. unlock Keep the, that thing, the thing. But being black, doesn't that mean you can go commit a crime or something? <laughs> okay, I'll just go check with the generator, man, no problem. You're from Israel. Oh, okay. Interesting. Does that mean you're a Muslim? Because I think you'd be our first Muslim viewer. If if that's the case. Is it Muslim or Muslim? I always think it's Muslim, but then some people say Muslim, so I don't know. I think you're probably our first Israeli viewer anyway. Oh god, what's in there? Jews live here. Oh! Oh yeah! That's right! <laughs> Sorry. Boy, didn't you hear the bell? I'm really bad with geography. Dinner time. I'm really bad with geography. Uh, what the hell is this? What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still gotta do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. Yeah, sure, brother. Are you the first atheist viewer digital cure? I highly doubt that. Seeing as I'm an atheist and I viewed my my own stream the first time I tested streaming, so oh, oh, I was the first atheist. You are an angel. Oh, Excuse me, miss. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and ain't been back no, inside. No, 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 please, no. Everybody sit down. Now go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a what? horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. I'm a little confused, Sophia. How can you be a Christian if you're an atheist? Maybe you should just think, just think Jesus was some cool dude who taught some good stuff. So I don't know. You're Russian, living in Israel, and you're an atheistic Christian. <laughs> 
gosh. Makes total sense. Oh shit. Hush. Hush, stair. You're supposed to walk on the sides, because that's where the most support is and where the wood won't bend. The, it'll bend the least. This guy's walking straight up the middle, the worst possible place. You found out you're not a Jew half a year ago. How do you find out you're not a Jew? Or are your parents Russian, but you were born in Israel or something? Oh, drugs. Gimme. What do they need so much morphine for? Box of candles, medical supplies, towel. Power cord. Huh, what is that cord going? Let's uh, attach it. Power some stuff. Oh, Sophia. I found out I'm a Jew like a bit effed up. Yeah, Mubot. Mubot automatically removes swearing and what have you. So. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. Be too saline. What do dairy farmers is. need with this kind of stuff? Yeah, what do dairy farmers need with this kind of tomfoolery? Your parents are Russian, you were born here thinking you're a Jew all your life. And now. But, so, why did you say you're a Christian and then you said you're an atheist, though? I don't understand that at all. I can't believe you went your whole life thinking you were, you were Jewish by uh, ancestry. <laughs> oh god. Lee. Mark. What the hell happened? to your legs, man! Don't eat dinner. <laughs> Clementine! Oh shit, oh shit, go, 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 got the fucking shit, holy crap. Holy crap, holy crap, holy crap, holy crap, holy crap, holy crap, don't be a cannibal! Oh dear, oh dear. Don't eat that! Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. No, you oh find my something? god, Ducky. Oh, sit your ass down, Ducky. Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just uh, can't stop. He could use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Oh, oh, scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Mom, oh, shit. I was oh, eating that. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. Oh, dear. It's true. Everything could have uh, turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. Oh my God. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. You're all sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. I didn't imply shit, I told you, bitch. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Oh dear. Like y'all. Oh shit. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! Oh shit. Oh fuck. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? Fucking what? Put your what? guns down! We're walking you out of here! Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay! Lee? Lee? Oh my god. You better let the fucking go of her. I'll kill you! Oh shit. It's legless man. Mark, Mark, you can't keep us in here. I forget. Sorry. Oh, 
Open up! I will tear you fuckers you apart with my bare hands! We gotta find another way out of here! Hey, X Robots. Welcome to the bastards. stream. Open this door, God damn it! <laughs> I will knock the goddamn <laughs> door down! Mark digivolved into a legless man. It, it was a person. So they tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, God damn it! If you hadn't dragged your feet! Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. You okay, Clementine? They, they didn't oh, hurt yeah. you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here, crawler. This goddamn <laughs> some sucker was the one who brought us here. Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. You're, you're worse than the walker, Dad. Please. Oh my god. Oh my god. What can we do? What's boxes, shelves? What's that? I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get- uh, uh, Oh dear. Uh, Easy! Uh, oh god. Dad? Oh. No. If he dies. Dad, come on! Walker. Dad! Dead. Oh god, oh, dear. he stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! If he's dead, he's we don't not want him. dead. You know what has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Oh dear. Lee! Oh dear. No morning later. But right now we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! He can Lily still can live. still save him. I wish he could. Believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Don't you have like two minutes Come on, before Lee, brain damage right or something? I know you you've got my minutes. back. You always do. God damn it, Lee! I need you. Please help me. We could, we could save my dad. No, Come on. Save, save, save. Lee, is he breathing at all? No, no, I don't think so. Well, we have to save. Let me take over. I hate Keep him. checking his pulse. Save him. No, don't you, sorry. Are you like... stupid? He's gonna turn. You're putting all of us at risk. You son of a bitch. What? You're fucking worthless. Three. Oh my god. No! <laughs> Kenny, what the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just. It had to be done. You don't know that. Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm oh sorry. My god. I know. Don't you fucking touch me. <laughs> Are you okay? Is it over? Yeah. Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. Shh. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Like what? Your walkie -talkie. How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad, don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. Wow, Liam. Wow. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? Oh, God. I'm working on it. Oh, my God. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. Was just trying to keep Jimmy, us safe. He made a bad call. It was premature for sure, but he was trying to keep us safe. Bullshit. He cares about keeping his family safe. He doesn't give a shit about you and he me. He puts his family first, sure. Just like Larry did. That's true. That's true. Shit, my balls. 
Oh, maybe he's got some useful stuff. Loot the corpse. I'm sorry, Lily. Can we? I'm sorry, Lily. No, I want to loot it. Well, I guess we can't. We gotta be sensitive. Hey, man. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got hey, to. Hey, man. We have to work together. Could you kill Katja or Duck? You talk a big game, but could you do the hard thing if it was Katja or Duck? It's never gonna come to that. Not if I have anything to do with it. For all we know, the St. John's might have... No! They, they need Katya, remember? Well, she's the whole reason they brought us here. And no doubt you're they're right. using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta get to him. That's all. You're right. You're right, boy. Now, where the fuck is a multi-tool? There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? Something I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. You can use a coin for this kind of thing. the trick. Do you have a coin? Mm-mm. Now does he have a coin? He has 60 Sorry, cents. Lee. Remember? He was gonna give 60 cents to the get get out of the way. Can please, I please loot him? I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Yes, please. Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Oh, God. Uh, yeah, guys, you can okay. stop saying that Larry has 60 cents. Yeah. I already the said that which <laughs> before anybody in the chat said that. So, no need to keep giving me that particular tip. Uh, it's probably the breast pocket. I don't want to go near his junk, man. Oh, it's butt. It's better than his junk. Huh. He still carried his wallet. Oh, look at that. Wouldn't the coins be in the wallet? Are you not going to check the wallet? Take his shoes, lick his toes, that's right. All right, this one's kind of close to his crotch. Dead man crotch. Mm. My mother's. Don't worry, I'm not taking it. So she is a something. Here we go. Do you even if you turn Two to quarters say? and a dime. Two quarters and a dime. Score. <laughs> yeah. Stealing from the white man. Just got to remove these screws and get this unit off. Money, 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 money. Money, money. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Hey, man, I'm turning them as fast as I freaking can. our way out, Lee. It's kind of small. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. Oh, dear. You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it.
Liam, you don't have to talk so, you know, detachedly of the game while we're playing it. Perhaps after the game or between chapters you can say, wow, Clementine is such a, an obvious plot device, but right now, let's keep the immersion level. I mean, you're not going to affect mine barely at all, but of the other people Are you watching. Okay? Did anyone see you? Where the hell are you going? What do you care? I care Kenny. about your family, Kenny. Lily, I'm sorry. We gotta go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. Hey, we're good. Okay? Okay. Yeah, this is good. Shit, he's gonna get us all killed. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's a freaking bench saw. But god, Lee's just gonna slip slip and slide her all around this place. Look at all the blood. Holy shit, they hang people here. There was something up at this room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. This is fucking nuts. Can I take this, please? I'll hook somebody. Don't care about the jars. Don't care about the vent. The mitre saw. God, what's wrong with these people? Holy shit, this place is nuts. This place is fucking nuts. people up here. The sickle. Holy shit. Ooh. Sophia, I still don't uh, understand, by the way, what you meant when you said you're a Christian and then you said you're an atheist. So, you don't have to, obviously, even mention it or anything, but I'm just interested. Let's go. Let's use the door. Can I just open the door, please? Throw a bear trap at them. That's right. That ought to get them. Can we? Let's go, Kenny. What the hell do you think you're doing? Getting my family back. What are you gonna do? Walk up and grab his gun? Good a plan as any. I've got the sickle, the, the hook, double hook thing, man. Don't even worry about it, I got this. Okay, what you do from here is charge, screaming madly. Yeah! Okay, that's how you do it in the movies, right? You use stealth right up to the point where you actually need it. You still need it. Hey, what are you doing outside the bar? Oh shit. Just guarding the place like you said. Man, sitting out in the rain like a damn deer, though. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. Can I pick which one to keep alive? Not to kill. Not enough meat on the tray. Uh, oh, I know, Mabel. This is my favorite now? part, too. When I let one think they can just walk right out. <laughs> We never see even where he is now. Tell me what's going on. Oh my god. This is not good, Kenny. This is not good. I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. Together. How? He doesn't know we're out. He's gotta walk past us to get to the meat locker. We can take him out when his back is to us. See what he's doing now. Oh shit. Hey there, he's gonna. Holy shit. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Oh, okay, 
you were born a Christian, but you, you, or you were, I suppose, raised a Christian, but you don't believe in God anymore. I see, I see. Of course I'm going to kill that motherfucker. Well, maybe we can use him as leverage. Lethal over again. You see? You understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's this how the so world fun. works now. Give part of yourself so others can live. I should fucking kill you right now. Cannibalism is not the answer. Aren't the walkers eating enough of us? You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. I'm gonna kill you, you motherfucker. <laughs> Go. I'll keep Clementine safe. Sorry I had to see that Clem, but that motherfucker had to die. He's gonna turn into a zombie, stab him in the brain. Something was up. What can we do? Mary's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Doc and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right. We're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. Oh my god, I'm cold. No, no, wait, no, no, no! Get shut up, you'll be fine. He just used flash. Oh, what's up? I'm gonna take the boy and check around no, a bit. Oh please, shit, oh shit. There you go, woman. Set her down. I don't wanna oh, hurt y'all. If we get right up close to the Andy? door, we can ambush Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? Oh, God. That's right, bitch. Come here. Let me go! Oh, Please shit. get back! Don't come in here! You just had to go snooping around, didn't you? Let her go, Brenda! Oh shit. Please! Please don't you take another step! Brit, come on now, you know you don't want to do this! Just go away and leave us be! Oh dear, oh dear. Stop right there, I mean it! Think about what you're doing. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee! Just let me go! We gotta fuck it towards her so she goes on the stairs. Stay back! Don't do anything! Stop! What? Okay, we died. <laughs> God damn it. Another step! 
Brent, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Stop right there. I mean it. Oh, stop him. Stop him. Think about what you're doing. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Brenda. Please, let me do it. I'll do it! Please! on yourself. No, uh-uh. You did this. All we wanted was a little gas to keep ourselves safe. Holy shit. You got me. <laughs> you ain't shit. It's over. Fuck you. As soon as Danny Mama get out here, you, you all fucked. <laughs> They're both dead. What did you do? What the fuck did you do? Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Let's 
go. Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yep. Yeah, they were. That is sick. God, just... Ugh. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? Oh, she knows. She's not stupid, Carly. She knows. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. Ah, <clears throat> hey Diddy Gaming, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hon, go on Possibly ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? You murdered Larry. Fuck you, man. You're alive because of me. Why didn't you have my back? I saved your wife and kid. No, I saved them. By making sure Larry didn't kill us. I couldn't do it, Ken. Well, maybe we should stay out of each other's way for a while. Come on, Kenny. Don't be like that man. I would have done what I had to, but... Stay close. Lee, did you have to kill those men? Yes, they were bad men, Clementine. They killed Mark and they were gonna kill all of us. They had to be stopped. Understand? Yes, I think so. Hey, Dad, what's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. Hello? Hello? Figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. That's right. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? She's got blue and a green eye. Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? 
We shouldn't take this. You're right. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. We'll survive without it. We'll survive without it. If you the want hell we will. people, then you shouldn't we'll steal find from way. people and lift them to die. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Okay, what have we got in here? Look, there's more food in that box. They have antibiotics. What else do they have? See if there's any water. Here. Oh my god, man. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Lee, there's a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna oh, see this. God. What is it? Because the car was out of gas. Welcome to the stream, Mana, by the way. Jake, Bart, Linda, and all y'all fucking sickos from the save lots. They call y'all bandits, but you're fucking rich. Oh, darling, baby, look at you. Look at you. Oh, you need a mama, sweetheart. We won't let them bandits get you, will we? No. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find thinking it, you're I'll safe. You know. Sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you gotta be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. People who do... Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise. This place is done. It's time to move on. Screw it. Not like you ever listen to a damned word I say. Come on, Kenny. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phases him. It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! Oh, dear. Okay. Oh, I did the popular things with everything except the stealing. How oh, interesting. Oh man.